I'm Pastor George Borkard, and this is another Higher Things video short. Galatians 6, 11. Large letters. It really was written by the Apostle. The Word of God is certain. That's the subject of today's Higher Things video short. Like, subscribe, ring the bell, donate. If you love what we're doing in Higher Things, pass it on the faith to the next generation. Like our videos, subscribe to our channel, ring the bell to get notifications, and give... or down here if you're an Android user, give today. Your tax-deductible gift, especially now, there's a need. Your tax-deductible gift helps higher things. Keep passing the faith at this time in which we need the faith. Passing the faith to the next generation. Galatians 6, 11 is the only verse we're going to see. Look <laughs> how large of letters I'm writing to you in my own hand. And you'll miss this verse, and you won't think about this verse, and this verse doesn't deliver salvation to you as much as it de de delivers to you how real the actual scriptures are. This isn't somebody translating some, some gold, gold plates in, um, in the Americas. This isn't... Um, Muhammad putting together a perfect religion. This is an old man writing Gal the Galatians. And he's writing with big letters. Because he can't see. This is the realness of God breathing words through his, through his apostle. Even a frail one named Paul. This is how certain and real the scriptures truly are. And we need to hear this in this day. In this day where everything is uncertain, in the day where everything is shaking, we need to hear this. The scriptures are the inspired God-breathed word of God, written by men, and written by men as a gift. They're human. And not in the sense that they're filled with errors, they're not. But these were real people in a real time. This isn't in a galaxy far, far away. This was Paul to the Galatians with his bad vision and big giant letters. And the God who does this, who delivers his faith to you in this way, wants to tell you it's going to be okay. My servants have been have written with big letters because they couldn't see my servants have been confined to quarters. My servants have had church canceled on them before. My servants have felt alone and I took upon all their sin and all their sickness and all their pain and all their blindness on the cross. The lights went out for me on the cross. The universe got dark when I was saving you. This is the trueness the realness of the Christian scriptures. Unlike other books that people claim to be religious, this, this book doesn't spare any punches. Paul couldn't see. Paul wrote with big ladders. That's what's going on. And there might even be a little bit of, Galatians, please listen to me, I'm an old man. How human is that too? When you read the scriptures, you're reading the God-breathed message of God's servants of old. And the spirit takes those words and they, he applies it, lawing you and gospeling you today in order to save you. So what might seem like a meaningless verse in the midst of all the stuff that's going on in our universe, is an important verse. God works through weakness in order to save. How profound is that? Think about that. Think about that. I'm Pastor George Borkart with my sleeping dog. And this has been another Higher Things video short.